Hey guys, this is Jerry Orr's Point for Kids First. Today we're reviewing the most classic animated movie of all time, Shrek. It's hilarious, it has a very original story, and the voice acting is stupendous. The adventure starts when Shrek, who is an ogre living in a swamp, kind of doesn't like other people. He kind of likes being alone and having a lot of privacy, but when the king, the local area, and the region he lives in, commands all fairy tale creatures like talking horses or uh, gnomes or things like that to relocate to the swamp, Shrek gets a little angry. So he goes to the king to say, hey, get these people out of my swamp. And the king says, okay, but first you must complete this quest for me. And the quest is to rescue this princess from a castle guarded by a large dragon. He meets friends like his classic companion, a do talking donkey named Donkey, and it's a huge adventure. If you like to find out what happens, you gotta watch the film. My favorite scene is when he finally gets into that ginormous, ginormous castle with the dragon and the princess. And what I love about that is, first of all, it's hilarious, it's unexpected. I'm not gonna spoil it for you, but it is one of the most hilarious scenes in the film. And also the animation on it is spectacular because do you remember that this came out in the very early 2000s when computer animation was just a very a new thing. It was completely and utterly new like 4K is today. It was very early in development technology. So to be able to see these giant castles, this dragon breathing fire was really spectacular. On top of that, the staging with the characters and the relationships between the dragon and other characters was very smooth and the fighting sequences was amazing, which made it not only a comedy but an action movie as well. Overall, I absolutely love the film. I think the story is completely and utterly original because it's kind of like that fairy tale story and has a lot of good morals in it, but it's also almost a giant parody of fairy tale stories, kind of breaking almost the fourth wall in fairy tale stories by saying the fairy tale creatures or saying I read it in a book somewhere. Kind of breaking that fourth wall was hilarious and I greatly enjoyed it a lot. Now, Shrek is definitely not meant for very young kids. First of all, the story is a little bit more mature, and also, there's some foul language, so I'd say about 8 to 18 would be good. I also definitely give it 5 out of 5 stars because not only is it a hilarious animated film with a classic story, it also has a fantastic voice cast who's, who's born to play the roles, and I definitely recommend it. If you'd like to see this film, it is now on DVD near you. I'm Jerry Yours, reporting for Kids First. Bye!